My name is Kimberly Jones. I'm a professor and chair of the Department of Civil and Environmental Engineering here at Howard. I went to Howard as an undergrad. I went away to grad school, and now I am back. I'm in engineering. Engineering is a male, heavily, heavily male-dominated field. There's not a lot of black folks in engineering. There's not a lot of women in engineering, so I hear the term double minority a lot. Well, I grew up in a kind of a matriarchal family. My father was in the house, grew up with both parents. My mom was pretty much the very strong, opinionated one. I also grew up with my grandmother, who was very strong, opinionated. She kind of ran the family. Actually, my godfather mentioned to me, I wanted to be an artist, then I wanted to be an architect. And one day we were talking, and he said, you're really good at math and science. Have you ever thought about civil engineering? I went to the library, and I looked up engineering, and I just fell in love with the idea of designing something. From then on, they kind of, Kim's going to be an engineer. You know, she's going to be an engineer. She, you know, so it was, it was nice. They kind of took that idea, and they, um, they went with it, and, and here I am. With my experience has been when I've been on these teams or on committees or on boards, just being a woman in a room full of men, I can see that there are differences in the way we think about things, the way we decide to come to a conclusion as a team, as a committee, as a board. When I left Howard, which is an HBCU, I went to Illinois, University of Illinois, and I was the only black person in their program, in the graduate program. At times I thought, you know, this, you know, sometimes when you're the only one, you think maybe you're the one who made the wrong decision. What started off as kind of an kind of an uncertain period. Actually, I, I, I began to enjoy it after a while because I, I felt like I was, you know, during the interactions I had with some of the students there, I, I, I think they learned a lot about me. I learned a lot about them. I'll tell women to women who aspire to be engineers or professors in engineering, to get PhDs in engineering or any of those um, professions, um, to think about what you want to do and just don't let anything stop you. You know, I actually had a young student come to me at a conference. Um, she worked in my lab. She's an African-American student at Howard. At lunch, she came to me and she said, you know, Dr. Jones, you realize you're the only black woman here? I said, you know, I hadn't thought of it because I'm used to it. But I told her, I said, you know, you can't really let who you are hold back what you want to do. Makers, 